go. Okay, come on, people. Hey, hey! Oh my goodness, it's getting hot in my room. All right. Okay, wait a moment. You know what, guys? It's only 4:19 in the afternoon here in our city in the Philippines. So during this time of day, it's very hot. And then when I dance, I sweat. So I need two mini fans. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's continue. <laughs> All right, come on, people. <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen, those in between. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Everett, and today we are going to be reacting to another Ong Ing Petman Things video. Sweaty crop, coffin crop. Thank you so much for stopping by. And to those of you guys who have been on this YouTube channel for the very first time, I would like you to check out my other reaction videos, especially my reaction videos to Ong Ang Fet Van Things videos. And if you like them, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for closing out this video. And of course, do me a little bit of favor, put a like on this video so that YouTube can also recommend this video to other viewers. All right? Anyway, speaking of Ong Ang Fet Van Thing today, we are going to be checking out Fet, uh, Ong Ng's very first vocal duet with Mei Jintra, who I believe is also a Morlam singer. And this is also going to be my very first time to be making a reaction video to Mei Jintra. Although, I've already seen her video in my recommended videos before. But at that time, I don't know, but for some reason I was like, I don't know. I was just not sure about making a reaction video to her latest music video but I think everything happens for a reason and everything has its own perfect timing and I believe that today is a perfect time for me to make a reaction video to Mei Jintra and of course with Ong Ang Pet Ban Feng but I don't exactly know what song they sing in this video this song is a little bit long it's just uh, I mean it's a 10 minute long video so all right <laughs> what are we waiting for let's get started <laughs> Alright, here we go. Mei Jintra. Mei Jintra in On the same stage. Alright, here we go. What is this? A ballad song? No, it's a Morlam song. <laughs> what kind of question is that? Okay, wait a moment. Why did they ask that question? Ballad or Morlam? Of course, this one is a Morlam song because both of them are Morlam singers. Alright, here we go. Alright. Okay, wait a moment. I'm so sorry guys. I don't know what's going on in the camera. Oh, I, okay. I think it's okay now. Alright, let's move on. Oh, the little girl is here, Joe's daughter. Hello. So the crap nong. <laughs> you guys say nong if somebody's younger in Thailand, right? And then if somebody is older than you, then you call them P, right? P Everett, right? P Everett, nong ong ing, nong me jintra, right? Because I think I'm older than them. So I call them Nong. Nong Ong Ing, Nong Mei Jintra. And then they call me P. Everett. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Okay, come on, people. Hey, hey. Oh my goodness, it's getting hot in my room. Alright. Okay, wait a moment. You know what, guys? It's only 4:19 in the afternoon here in, in our city in the Philippines so during this time of day it's very hot and then when I dance I sweat so I need two mini fans okay <laughs> okay let's continue 
All right, come on, people. All right. Okay, wait a moment. I need to know what the title of this song is. Please let me know in the comment section below because um, the title of the song is not included in the title of the video. Let's move on. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, <laughs> girls. Mm. All right. Come on, people. <laughs> this is an upbeat song, but I, I love the fact that both of them, Mei Jintra and Ong Eng, still do that vocal slur like Okay, now wait a moment. I need to ask you this question. I'd like to know how old Mei Chintra is. Please let me know in the comment section below. And also, if you guys have any idea, how long has she been in Thai music entertainment industry? How long has she been a singer? Thank you. Because I, I, I can feel that Ong Eng, even though this is her very first time to be performing with Mei Jintra, she is so comfortable doing this vocal duet with this amazing Thai artist, Mei Jintra. Anyway, let's move on. Okay, I, I love the fact that the two of them are having fun on the stage and I can tell that they really connect with the audience and in my personal opinion, this is one of the most important things which an artist should do when they perform live. The fans are so generous and kind-hearted. Wow! Okay, you know what guys, to be honest, I am touched by how generous the fans are. The fans are really generous and benevolent and really kind-hearted. Like every time I watch Ong Ying perform, the fans really makes really make it a regular effort to give something to her while she's performing. Ah, oh, that's very very touching. Hello, May. Hello, Mr. Drummer. Okay, I don't exactly know what you guys technically call that vocal slur, like, hey, like that. Like, I mean, even though this is an upbeat song, I am, I am really impressed by the fact that they still do that. 
Hey, hey. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't do it. Ah. Are you guys having fun? Okay, now, before we move on, again, I would like to say this, I really love this culture, tip culture, uh, culture about giving something while somebody performs. It's very, very touching, and at the same time, it goes to show that the fans, the audience, really appreciates what these artists are doing are on the stage, right? Anyway... <laughs> okay, now, here's the thing. The more I listen to more Lam music genre, the more I appreciate this music genre. Really. Okay. Hello, Mr. Drummer. So we've got another song. Okay, I, I really would love to sing along, but unfortunately I am not familiar with these songs at all. Ah, you're having fun! <laughs> Come on, people! Sing if you can! Mm. Sing if you can! If you know the song, come on! Make some noise! I'm actually trying to guess. I don't know what Ong Ng is saying here, but I'm like, Vince, sing along if you can, if you know the lyrics of the song. They seem to be very close with each other. <laughs> Whoa. So many of you guys in the comment section told me that Ong Ng has this concert every single night. I am just amazed by the number of people who attend her concert every night. Just wow. Wow. Joe's daughter right in the middle of the stage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
they actually seem to be very very close to each other really whoa oh my goodness wow yeah Okay, first of all, I love the chemistry between Ong Eng, Fat Ban Peng, and Jay, uh, Mei Jintra. I feel like the two of them have known each other for such a long time. I mean, this is their very first time to do a vocal duet together, but I feel that they are very comfortable with each other. I feel that the two of them have a very close relationship like an older sister and a younger sister relationship you know what i mean i love that the two of them were just having fun on that stage and of course the fans were so generous like they were so giving and i feel so touched by the amount of love and support coming from the fans and to be honest if i were ong Eng or if i were mei jintra I would be really deeply moved by the generosity and the support coming from the fans. But overall, this is such a fun-filled vocal duet. I love that the two of them know how to connect with the fans, how to connect with the audience. Sorry about that, vehicles. <laughs> but anyway, I want to say that they really know how to connect with the audience. And when it comes down to performing live, this is very important. So guys, please let me know what you think of this video in the comment section below because of course your opinions matter too. So that's about it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if you like this video, hit the like button, hit subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified when the next video comes out. Peace out. <laughs>